inside the earth and under the sea. But their dead bodies had told their secrets and dreams to the first men who formed a cult which has never died. This was that cult, and the prisoners said it had always existed and always would exist, hidden in distant wastes and dark places all over the world, until the time when the great priest Cthulhu, from his dark house in the mighty city of Relia, under the waters, should rise and bring the earth again beneath his sway.
Stranger, you can call me Hieronymus Flex because I'm on the lamp. Oh, want to flex like me? Call me one, two, one, three, three, four, three, nine, four, two, three. Lodge and losses. I give you all my blood, Alexa. Robot got missing limb. See into other people's thoughts. Learn a library's worth of knowledge in moments. Wield powerful magic incantations. Live for thousands of years. Only 20 septums a bottle. Found the blood elixir. The one and only. Only 20 gold septums.
awesome to uh, get this baby set up. play Starfield then. You don't want to play Baldur's Gate with me. Madness. Anyway, I look like a mess. Woke up. Made breakfast. Hung out a bit. They're playing board games out there. Play a video game. Get it to show up now. Please. Sorry about that. screen maybe that'll work better better yeah did you say better say a word rosie rosie just heard that you like that yeah right straight up talking got words Screaming baby. There it is. Is it going up now? Uh, 
cosmetics that I need. Buy it. But the quest wanted me to get some of them. Anyway, I rolled back my save to before I attacked these pirates. Yes. Oh, I didn't want to do um. Alright. What am I doing? Gets to me. You know, this is uh, another gunship song, Ghost, I think. Just a sweet music video. So dark. Anyway, Pirates of the West, anti venom. Mush. Probably less. I just want to see if it completes the quest. Instead of stealing from them, you could just buy it. Well, don't be like, hey, give me that. Alright. Cover intact. No one knows we just made a legitimate sale, right? I'm not going to follow paper trails and need lasers anymore. Power them down. Get our shields up and our grav drives up. Yeah, shields and grav drives. That's right, baby. Cool. Now what? <laughs> now we have no mission. Oh, we gotta bring it to the... At the course. All the way back there. Jump to Sagan. Stream yesterday, the audio cut out, but I can't do it. I wonder if that's again, that might have been the music that was you playing. Copyright. You got her dinner in the bear. Shame. Content, man, we have donkey. It's a song of CRPG donkey. Pen. You'll write her letters. You'll think that fuck her every night. Sorry, friend. I keep you a fair fight. She's already mine. Oh, but good. Remember this. Alright, young scrolls. Hey, please don't get to me. Heartbreaker. I'm a heartbreaker. I'm a heartbreak. Pretty good. Heart too cold. And heart too touch. I'm a heartbreak. I'm a heartbreak. Anyway. Let's have regular soundtrack now. Here we are in space. Space station pirate. Space station pirate, welcome. Like to board. Be yeah. sure and check your pockets when we leave. Be certain you still have everything in them. Look at this place. Again, we just ripped off uh, a lot of the environment designs of. Not ripped off, but. Fired by Star Citizen. Definitely very similar to Grimhex. You know what? Nobody's played Star Citizen though, and everybody's going to have played this. So now, Need something. Star Citizen will have ripped off the game in everyone's perception. 
Isn't that, my friends, how history is written by the victors? <laughs> Good job, Todd Howard. You beat him. Beat Chris Roberts at his own game. He's still got more money than you, though. For now. Maybe not. I don't know. Kind of name is Sis Def, anyway. I am looking to start something. I'm going to stop, stop talking shit about the gaming industry before I get in trouble. Right, nobody cares. They're going to laugh their way all the way to Mars. Or spaceships. I'll be a space pirate. Yeah, you want to be a space pirate too? <laughs> Being sucks, that's funny. Um, so I went on Mods Nexus. I didn't actually get any mod. Oh, one that makes the jetpack sound better. I kind of just want that. It adds like turbines to it. I was like, that'd be awesome. More of a. <laughs> Oh, are you fed up now because you ran out of snack? How about a cracker? Got some circle crackers over here. Yeah. You want the bottle? The bottle. Here. Alright. Not too much of that. And sodium gonna enjoy it. I will eat some too. Crinkle, crinkle. Sis Def probably thinks we're a bunch of mindless marauders. <laughs> oh, hey. We're an ops back to differ. Until next time. Oh. Until next time. How do I this in? Game, where are you leading me? Give me a path. Pirate space stations are confusing. Yeah. Give me this little side eye. <laughs> little half smile. Maybe. Come here. Hey, hey. You're on TV. Hi. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's a baby. She is the best. So was my other daughter. Those two are the best two babies that could have possibly existed. Adam. That's it. No dispute. Let's see? You want to survive? Wait. My gear may not be bulletproof. Nobody's disputing that. Let's not do any more piracy missions. Kind of a waste. <laughs> I don't want to kill people and piss off my whole crew. I suppose I could just leave them all home. Everybody at the lodge and just go out and murder. Doesn't really seem like the right thing to do, though. During the fate of the galaxy. Or is it? I don't know. Right now, we're just curious. We're probably... Gonna create the problem. Right. Hey, um, I wanted to thank you one last time for not ratting me out to Delgado and telling him how much I pitched in. That was pretty damn cool. 
If he would have found out what I was planning, well, I don't even want to think about what could have happened. Oh. I'm planning to take him out. What? No, you got to be crazy. All I'm going to do is lay low for a while, pick up a few jobs from Voss, and maybe get drunk. <laughs> Oh, just remember, owe me a favor. Oh, yeah, sure. Anything you need, you just ask. And I'll be there to back you up. Uh huh. For your sake, I hope you are sincere. You just, uh, you know, uh, take care of yourself out there. That's probably not the nicest thing to say, but I still don't like him. So don't. I'm gonna toss to an old friendly. One of the best pirates I ever knew. For you. <laughs> pirates and <clears throat> What could go wrong in a place like this? Nothing at all. Uh you doing, bro? Are you getting out of there? Come on. I can. I don't know. Babe, right next to me. Realize what. I'll can sit in here. No more of that. Let's open a window. Really out today. Talk to Mathis. Yeah. Sean, you're too scared to take the key. Because of Ava. We have to decide the whole set of systems on the run someday. There you are. All right, look. I've been lining up a score with that asshole roll call from the Siren of the Stars for months. I'm not about to let a payday slip through my fingers. So guess what? You're going to finish the job for me. Instead of trawling deep levels. space for stick change, we got a much bigger target right here at home. A lot of jingle in those pockets, Bog. Could use a good shit. Who the hell if I knew what you were talking about? I'm about to tell you, so shut up and listen. Wolkov's been tipping me off about some kind of bullshit charity event that the Siren of the Stars is hosting. At the event, they're gonna give away something called the Earth Savior Award, which is worth tens of thousands of credits. So it's simple. While you're on the siren, swiping those gal bait credentials, I want you to grab that award and bring it to me. Um. I don't like taking unnecessary risks. Then why the hell are you here? We take unnecessary risks every day. That's what being a pirate is all about. Look, you can make all the jokes and excuses you want. But if you don't come back with the ES award, I'm gonna deduct it from your pay. Either way, I get my money. How much you walk away with is in your own hands. Got it? I suppose it is up to you to decide whether it is worth it. Is that like first? Portion. What's this award again? Yeah, ES, Earth, Savior. Get it? Save the Earth? Come on. Keep up with me here. I got about 17 other things to do, and you're holding me up. Broke off, gonna cut. 
All Rope Hawk does is feed me information. Oh, if man, I ask him to practice. lift a finger, oh, yeah. he gives me enough sob stories to fill a freighter's cargo bay. If you want my advice, leave him completely out of the loop. Otherwise, it's gonna cost both of us some credit. Um, <clears throat> maybe I'll just take the pay cut and save myself the trouble. You do whatever you want. I'm trying to offer you extra money and you're throwing it in my face? I'm gonna remember that. All right, Rook, we're done here. Now, get your ass to the siren and bring me my goods. I keep getting called a Rook. Because that's exactly what you are. A rookie, a newbie, fresh meat. Beneath all of that inexperience, I'm sure you have an actual name. But honestly, no one gives a damn. So get used to hearing that word. Until you earn your stripes, you're a rook to everyone in the fleet. Talk later. No, I hear you. Give me a moment. I gotta take this baby out. I'll take her out. But take her out of this room and change her diaper. Got what she I think she wants to be free. Go free the baby. Hold on. All right. Baby's in the pack and play now. I think she'll be all right there. It's better perks. I need to get off my ass and do a job.
I appreciate that you may have business here. I would simply ask that you conclude it quickly. Bulk grog is fine if you like cheap moonshine. Give me an Erdebrau Loga and I'm good. I want that guy's opinion on it. I don't care. I didn't ask. matter what I think. I just keep my head down and my weapon high. You should do the same. Hey, I like taking chances. You can do whatever you want. Me, I like staying alive. Is Mina seeing anyone right now? The patients, I mean. I gotta sort him. Nothing like the smell of a dead shark after you cook him with an energy blast. You know, I thought you guys were having a real conversation. You just started hitting me with nonsense. All right, back to our ship. recognize me. Let me watch it. Straight back to be an informant. other star. planet check all these planets while we're here no we have to fly over there don't we? and just jump between planets and like survey you want to do that for money though.
Okay. Let's continue our mission. Go to some air from here now. Acknowledged. You're clear to dock at docking port one. The commander will be waiting for you in operations. I cannot wait to see how the UC is throwing its weight around today. You don't want to be on the pirate station. You want to be. Great, just back in the pod. Fire. Fine. Walk away like Cis Def Marines are the best of the best. I bet operations on the key are a clown show. I'm looking forward to reading your report. Ooh. Word is the fleet has Anything chased new to ghosts on Suvorov. Well, if there's one thing spookier than a pirate. Nice work. Let me take a look. Pick this up from the lock. It's amazing that all this romantic nonsense about Crix's legacy really just amounts to a rumor Jasper Crix picked up in jail. It just goes to show you how a tiny rumor can snowball into a full-blown fairy tale. Anything else? That's Understood. It. Keep searching and you're bound to find more. any SysDef resource. We'll provide you with information, but any inventory or ship services, it's best you get from the fleet. It'll help you maintain your cover and also give you an idea of how the fleet's operation works. We'll be here if you need us. Yo, back. So how did it go? Hmm. Why are you so surprised to see me? Frankly, it's because we've never gotten this far before. The last agent I sent to infiltrate the Crimson Fleet ended up in a morgue on New Atlantis. Oh? On second thoughts. You stop now. Delgado will make it his life's work to hunt you down and kill you. 
Not to mention the fact that you could potentially jeopardize the intelligence operatives we have in the field. Lieutenant Toft is correct. I'm sorry, but there is no turning back. That being said, I believe you should be proud of what you've accomplished. I was certain we'd fool Delgado, but never. She's a sharp one. Overcoming her scrutiny is no small matter. Did you discover anything worth reporting yet? He's looking for his legacy. Legacy. Why does that sound familiar? Wait a moment. Know about it. Are you telling me Delgado may have actually located Crix's legacy? I have never heard of such a thing. I'm surprised. I oh. thought this was one of those tales that made it to every corner of the settled systems. I suppose it's possible, sir. Intelligence picked up a bit of chatter on that subject recently. We assumed it was some sort of tall tale or a story to attract recruits to their cause. A bunch to do today still. Um, or you're not. He thinks it's right. Well, let's find out if Delgado is chasing ghosts, or he's smarter than we suspect. Let me see what we have here. Nope. There are no records of a Gal Bank transport named the Legacy in the database. <laughs> I think Delgado's trying to manipulate you. What do you think, sir? I think there's no record because Galbank is hiding something. Delgado's no fool. If he risked his own neck to get that information, then he must be on to something. We have to take this seriously. What's your next move? Galbank's hiding something. Can you imagine the amount of embarrassment Galbank would have to endure if they listed a lost transport in the ship registry? Doesn't matter if that ship went down five or five hundred years ago. If news gets out that a bank has misplaced money, it would tank their value. I didn't think that the banks still existed. They are just fine. I'm supposed to. Florida Starliner to come back after Clever, Delgado. Very clever. If I were in your place, I'd be trying to do the exact same thing. We can't let Delgado get his hands on what could potentially turn out to be the largest haul of credits the Crimson Fleet's ever seen. Maybe I should head out to New Atlantis, sir. I could press the Galbank execs for information. Get ahead of everything. No. Let's allow this to run its course. We have our agent here feeding us information. I think that's good enough for now. There's more to this than just finding the location of the transport. Jasper Crix was clever. And for some reason, he never got there. How do you know he never found it? Because the Crimson Fleet would be a totally different adversary. And Crix wouldn't have disappeared years ago. Even if they hid the money with that damn human computer, Shinya Voss, our forensic accounting people would have found that data. No, the Crimson Fleet are in dire shape right now. They haven't seen that much currency, well, ever. All right, I'll proceed as planned then. It's imperative that you do. If the Crimson Fleet gets its hands on a transport full of currency, it would be disastrous for the settled systems. I need you to do whatever you can to bring us more information. And for God's sake, don't kill anyone on that Starliner. You're both dismissed. Okay, I'll try not to. Heard you boarded the key. 
can't imagine what state the pirates have left it in. Do what Commander Ikande says, and you'll go far. Always a satisfying moment to return to your ship. Burning cracker crumbs. Thank you. 
will never grow weary of seeing places like this. Oh god. Uh, right off the bat. Facers. Okay, here we go. <coughs> <coughs> Polygons. Oh my gosh. That was a hack. A hack. I was hacking. Stop it. As hell, if him has some performance.
What does your scanner reveal? Play this game. You're getting super tired every time. All right. Have a good one. I love you. <laughs> 